Ladies and gentlemen, to those among you who are easily frightened, we suggest you turn away now. To those of you who think they can take it, we say, welcome to the Madhouse. Oh, 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 so good to see all my friends. Oh, 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 this is the makeup for a bad romance. I need you to subscribe and tell all your friends you and me could start a bad romance. Oh, because I'm supporting your makeup addiction, you and me could start a bad romance. Oh, 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 oh. need all your subscriptions. Oh, 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 and if you like it, hope you'll read at the end. Gaga, ooh la la, Tatiana, Romama, Beatface, Honey.com, stay tuned, better romance. <laughs> now I'm taking the stupid bow out of my hair. We're going to start by lining our eyebrows, and Lady Gaga has this winged shape going on to her brow. Top and bottom, this time for a more defined brow. And I'm going to take out my extension. And wing it. Use saddle to fill in the brow with an angled brush. Now going in with a concealer brush and my trusty old painterly for a base. MAC Paint Pot. I am going to highlight under my brow with this. And most times I would not just go right under my brow with a paint pot. But I purposely am doing this because I want the color to be white, white. And for those of you who have never heard of a brand called Coastal Scents, it is an inexpensive product. Oh, can you see, even see that? It's an inexpensive product that you can get only online. I'm going to use the very top, and I'm going to work that all the way under my brow. Okay, now that that's on, I'm going to take my trusty NYX, and you can go crazy with this. Ooh, I forgot. Very important. Before you do that, pull out some tape if you've got it. This is just regular old scotch tape. I'm going to start from the outer corner of my eye. Make sure you work it real good into your lash line. And I'm going to take my finger and just work that in. I'm not going to go up too high, just for the most part staying within, with on the lid. I'm going to go in with Carbon Max Matte Black and a 213. And I'm just going to pack. And now I'm going to work it upwards, blending it, and you can get it right in here. And taking an angled brush and my carbon, I'm just going to work outwards where the tape is. I'm going to rub off my angled brush and go back in with a silver that is also from the Coastal Scents palette on the opposite side. Very top, right there. And now I want to go in and take care of this area. Really, starting down here, I want to work upwards without making it super, super black. So I'm not going to put a lot on my brush, but I'm going to draw the line, drawing the line from my brow down 
a guideline and now I'm just going to work it up all the way into my brow. I want to take a dark brown, handwritten from MAC, and work over. And I'm going to take a Q-tip and just kind of spread that because it's not like super, super, super defined. And you know, guys, in between these takes, I'm going in and I'm touching up and I'm fixing. I mean, I'm cramming into 10 minutes, probably 30 minutes worth of makeup. So if you don't get it right, by all means, I mean, you got to just keep adjusting and keep working on it. I'm going to take an angled brush and go into carbon and make a line and just blend that in. Now I just kind of want to touch up the white. So I'm going to go back in with the Coastal Scents. So we can go ahead and remove the tape. And now I'm going to go in with some concealer. We can go in with eyeliner. Eyeliner. Gonna put that all under here. And I'm gonna go in with an angled brush and just smudge that out. And the video, her extension here isn't exactly perfect, so I just kind of want to smudge it out just a little bit. Now I'm gonna go in with mascara and a lash. I'm gonna put mascara on the bottom and put my lash on the top, which is a MAC 44. And I'll be right back. Okay guys, now we can start our blush. So, to do that, I'm going to use one of my favorite um, blushes from MAC, and this I use to contour all the time uh, because it's a little bit reddish what she's got going on. And I'm gonna take an angled brush. So I'm going to start in the hollow of my cheek. You can go like that to better be able to see it, but see how lightly I'm going here? Using the very, very tips of the brush. Taking a teeny, what's left on the brush, and so faintly, so, so, so faintly, right on the balls of my cheek. Okay, somehow I accidentally erased myself putting on lipstick, so, so sorry about that. But uh, I used Revlon's Why Not, a brand that I bought at like a wig shop in Atlanta, uh, SYL, for a lip liner. And I put NYX, a dab on the center of my up and um, upper and lower lip. Uh, as usual, you can go to my website to find out what products that I've used, um, and I hope you guys enjoyed this. Oh, and I want to be friends. Check out my Facebook. I do want to be friends, so join me on Facebook, and as always, I will see you at BeFaceHoney.com. Bye.